Oh. <laughs> do you have any idea what identity theft is? I do not. Well, I'm here to tell you what it is. Identity theft is when a criminal uses your information to start new credit accounts or a fraud account that oh. you don't know about. Actually. Oh, okay. Well, it happens by finding access to your credit card or bank account information. Like, for example, their internet. From people posing as legitimate companies asking you for contact information. Also, records, mail, because they could steal your mail, including your bank and credit card statements, and ATMs, because they could capture your ATM information. And direct theft is by stealing and running away from you oh. with your wallet. Oh, so like this one right here, they could take this? Yeah, they could. Oh. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, well thank, thank you for thank you for letting me know. Well, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Good answer, but there's also a couple things you can do. Secure your social security number at all times. Don't carry your social security number with you all the time. And protect your wallet at all times because you know that's where everything is. Okay, I'm just yep, yep. Oh, okay, I'm just there you go, you see it live. Thank you so much. For How does one fix identity theft? You would get a copy of your credit report from all your three credit reporting agencies. You would dispute the transaction that was not legitimate. You would then contact um, your homeowner's insurance company to see if you have identity theft protection. If you do, then you would need to um, have them help you take care of cleaning up your credit because there would be fees involved possibly. Um, and then you'd want to put um, a fraud alert on your credit report and just alerting people that you are a victim of identity theft and that way they can make sure that this is you who's actually applying for credit in the future. That's it. Okay. Yes, the watermelon. <laughs> Find a stylish mom. Stop! <laughs>